Good evening and welcome back to The Crust where I don't know what I'm doing today I've been only run for a little tiny bit and looking at things here I've put more power in because we actually didn't have enough power to run everything we still don't technically we need more power than we're producing so that's a bit of a pain um, but um, I'm looking at things going on here stuff's working, stuff's doing well but we do have a small problem of not enough silicon like there's no silicon <laughs> we don't have any silicon so that's what we were going to do today we were going to put in some more extractors to try and get some silicon going so let's see whether we can um put one there oh, it literally looks as if i can get one on that whole node not one that's there not one's there or there or there nope okay so we can get one extractor on here that's nice groovy okay i mean it's better than nothing and we will wire that directly in to um these run out so i've shut these down uh we're gonna run that into we can wire that directly into any of these i suppose can't we we really need to get an mdr going i think the thing upstairs might be built now i'm not sure though um let's just plug you into oh no there let's do that Boom. Ow. yeah i want to upgrade that because that needs to be um yeah uh and then when we mining out some other uh here yes right so let's um Oh, we might have to get multiple ones in here. Oh, uh, we can get one there. We can get one there. And we can get one there. Nice. I like it. Oh, no. Go in there, go to there, and then you can connect to that one, that one, and that one. And then we have a belt coming out there. You connect to that one, and you connect to that one. There we go. And you come along. And uh, have to go around and plug into that thing, I suppose. So go around that and plug into... Actually, come down plug into there seems like a bit of a waste doing all that belt but i can merge up there but i'm not going to i'm going to build it there urgent contract available what do you want titanium we don't have silicon so no um i have been doing some contracts for up to 1.46 million which is quite nice um um that's 60 so that's 60 coming in this is that coming in and then that would all merge there and this is a faster belt coming through so that will be fine. that will be fine. How are we doing up here? This is built. Awesome. Let's turn this off. Um, because it's using 100 power. So that, yeah, it's going to munch our power. Um, I'm not quite sure what's that silicon deposit thing there. What's that all about? There's not a silicon deposit there. It's an ice deposit. Uh, let's tell this to build us a mobile drilling rig. Okay. And we'll see how it goes. Um, I put in two storages up here for the control units and the composites. Uh, mainly because the control unit was full and I thought rather than just waste it we'll have it moved down so yeah uh, and I've also gone around and en enabled every machine that drones can drop into every machine so if we get stuff stored upstairs hence why our silicon's run out uh, the, the rope the um the box will now bring it back down again um to bring it in here just to just to keep the the stuff going I mean, we need we need more stuff what I need is more power and that's the biggest problem we have in here we need way more power we're not charging enough during the uh the um the uh the daylight hours we're not charging enough so oh. no what's happened there can i get one in there no okay okay there we go. Right. let's get some solar panels going on the end because um 
we're only charging the batteries to well not even halfway um so uh and the whole uh, uh oh it should be like this many to this many and um you know like like three solar panels to one battery is usually what i go for and i'm starting to think it might be two to one battery instead it, it very much depends on supply and demand um it, it not supply and demand, on demand um you want enough solar panels so you want enough batteries to run your factory so your factories it says up here if you bounce over the power one it says their maximum consumption 2348 we have 2400 so we have enough batteries to run our entire uh, base so this is enough batteries for the whole base however we also want to have enough solar panels to charge those batteries almost to 100 percent you want to basically get them to 100 percent charge in the 14 days that you have daylight so you need to kind of counter it and the thing with that is that the higher you are on your uh power usage obviously during even during the day you're still consuming that power so it's like you need twice the amount of power coming into what about yourself this this produces 50 um so you want to produce 100 power and the solar panels at peak can produce 85 they're 75 normally so it's 75 150 and you want 100 per go 150 225 so it's it's three to two three to two so you have twice the amount of power coming into the batteries as gonna so it should be a three to two um power system i would think we don't have that here do we no we've got three to one we're doing three to one we should actually charge these batteries way faster but we're not doing that uh, so i've got three to one here but here i've got three to two and here i've got three to two mostly and then i put more batteries in which we can that so when, when we add these in here we will be on the three to two ratio but we'll be a little bit over because we've got these additional ones here that i can't put inside so so yeah so three to two actually looks like it should be right because that would be 75 150 225 and two of these can produce 100 double that is 200 it's the closest you can get because 75 obviously we've upgraded these solar panels so they now produce 85 instead so that's helping as well but yeah i think i think that's the problem i think we're not on a three to two ratio we're not um uh how, how many how many batteries do we have one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven eight nine eighteen twenty seven thirty six one forty two forty three forty four forty five forty six forty seven forty eight forty nine fifty that's not right oh yeah one's down yeah one's one's offline that's what i say so fifty so if we're doing a three to two um uh, 50 divided by two times three we should have 75 solar panels uh 9 18 27 36 45 54 63 72 81 no not three to two not three to two hmm yeah because this is three to one then this is three to, to, to two this is three to two so that's yeah so this is it. so and, and i'm not charging them enough at all so so maybe it's not maybe it's closer to um three to one i think i think that was what i originally went with o originally previously in previous saves i've gone three to one and my powers never really had this sort of problem where it's not charging enough during the day during the day cycle so and this one i've gone three to two so yeah i think i, I should have gone three to one should it should be three to one three solar panels one one um battery and then flip it three solar panels one battery and then it should be flipped so there should be more solar panels here so um yeah i also need to test because um i believe that if like this is dead here and this is on a straight line coming through to a solar panel or a, a power line because this is broken it will cut the line off and the power won't stop but apparently that's not a thing now although i've not confirmed that so i need to double check that um no i want those uh, no i want those um so yeah we need to, we need to double check that as well but i can't do that in this save really because but the only way i could do it is to basically plug everything into this one solar panel here maybe um and then wait for it to break and see whether our entire power, power fails if i plug it into this one and disconnected this line here which is 
uh, risky, but, um, well, it's nowhere near. This, this one's near breaking. This one's near breaking. Maybe, maybe we'll do that. Maybe if I connect this to, oh, I can't. Um, I do want to test that. I do want to test that. But I'm not sure if it's going near or not. We don't have enough power. During the, um, the night time when the solar panels go down, we, um, we do have enough power to run the module, but it's if there's not, ah, oh, I think it's because, um, actually some of our things have shut down. Yep. I think some of our, um, mines are done. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's done. So let's get rid of that line. These are done. So let's get rid of, right, where's this go? This goes out to there. This one's shut down. What's this titanium? Okay, so let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of this line, actually. We don't need the line in there at the moment. Get rid of those. Don't need that. Which means I could rejig this whole thing here. I'm not going to, I'm just going to leave it as it is for the moment, so it's fine. Um, I don't know whether that will save us any power or not. Right, give me pause again a moment. How are we doing? Right, you're nearly dead. I'm going to cut off this power line here, and I'm going to connect you to there, and then I'm going to cut off that power line there. So our entire power grid now, bum, 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 is only connected to our main base via this one solar panel. It's not connected up here anywhere. It's not connected anywhere else. It's just purely connected by this one here. Also, I did not know as you mouse to mouse around with the solar panel, it shows you all the uh, things. Didn't know that. Um, so when this breaks down, which it will do soon-ish, um, we'll see whether our power grid fails completely. That's how we know. That's how we know whether it still works or not. Because I think it does. I think when things break down, uh, they stop transmitting power through them. But they, 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 if it breaks, it breaks completely and it won't transfer all the power through it. But if it doesn't, then that means I don't have to worry about having the redundancy of all these power lines in here. Which saves on a tiny amount of space. Not a great deal. Tiny amount of space. Um, but does save on resources. Because each one of these uh, these uh, things is, is a, a steel ingot. Which, um, yeah, isn't a lot, but... It's still something, you know. Uh, right, do you have... Right, I'm going to wait for you to get all the resources. Then we're going to unpower, uh, power you back up again. Because we don't actually technically have the power to run you, so... Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's see whether this happens. Or whether everything works just fine. Uh, we get some more solar panels built down here. That should allow us to charge our batteries a bit better. So, yeah. Um, I have not unlocked the... Well, I have unlocked the sort of large solar panel. I don't feel this is worth building, uh, personally. Um, it takes up as much space as nine um, Mark ones, Mark II uh, medium solar panels um, and doesn't produce anywhere near the power. So these are 75. Ignore the 85 because that's an upgrade. These are 75 by default. Um, uh, 75 times... Uh, 75 times uh, nine is 675 power. This is 300. If this produced 600, I reckon it'd be worth building. Yes, it drops down. You you lose basically one solar panel inside it, but it's worth it. Even if it was 500, it might be worth it because it only requires one piece of maintenance. It doesn't require nine pieces of maintenance. So, yeah. Okay. So our power didn't die that night. That's good. Power didn't completely die that night. So that's, that's good to know. The power did survive. We're testing, still testing this. This should shut down in, in typical fashion. Most things just, they, you seem to blink and they require repairs. Um, but when actually I'm looking at something to require repairs, it's not, it's not doing it. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, the other thing as well is that the, um, you don't instantly get like a hundred percent power from them. You see, this is building up um, at the peak on the seventh day of the 14 day sun. That's when they'll get the, um, uh, full, uh, 85 power. Um, I think they get it before that. They last longer. Okay, so that's that's now powered down. That so this is broken. This is broken, and our power source is still fine. So no, it doesn't do that anymore. You you no longer have to um, uh, do all this redundance power thing power that I keep doing. So um, power can still transmit through things, even when they're broken. And that's back online again, and we're all good. Awesome. Okay. I'm going to reconnect that, uh, I'm going to disconnect that, and I'm going to connect this solar panel to it as well, just to get that extra one plugged in there, so we get a bit more. As you can see, they're still building, so we're up to 56. 
Um, I don't know what day we're on from that, but you can see the sun. Uh, where, where, let's go to the let's go to the map view. But on, you can see we're uh, we're approaching the midway point. So I th I think they build up to the midway point and then start dropping down again. So their maximum peak is eighty five. Um, or should be 85. Don't, doesn't look like it right now. It's going to about 50 and stopping. Which is weird. Um, oh, that's something else. I've 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 not count I've not I've So they have a charge rate. They have a maximum charge rate. It's a hundred. So right, pause a moment. So I've got um uh 9, 18, 27, 36, 50. So that's um, 50 is going to be 5,000 charge rate at 100. Charge rate is 100. No, that's how much they're charging by. No, that's not the actual. No, okay. I thought they had a limit to their charge rate. And I was like, oh, maybe I've got too many solar panels. Maybe it's too many solar panels. It's not charging. No, it's not. The charge rate is changing. interesting so this one's got 65 this one's got 58 this one's 64 this one mm -hmm. why are the solar panels down here getting less charge than the ones up there oh, what's happening here i do know i do i do no longer understand yes english much i speak not um I no longer seem to understand this. So the power is dropping now. So it never hit the 85 peak anyway. Might be to do with the charge rate. I don't think so. I don't think it's there's there's a limit to how much they can charge. Um Well there is. The maximum charge is 250. So there is a limit to how much they can charge. Like so they can charge at 250 and output at 50. But it didn't get anywhere near that. Which it wouldn't do because um 27, 36, 45, 54, 63, 72, 81, uh, 90, 99, 102, uh, 102 times 85, um, it's 8,760 divided by 50 is only 173.4. So I do not know why these are not. I don't know why why these ones have got a higher 26 and these ones are now down at 21. I don't understand it. I don't understand it at all. I don't know. I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get I don't understand it. So even though we've upgraded them to be better, they're not. They're not charging the batteries fast. I don't know. Just don't know. Just don't know. I have to ask the experts on that. So anyway. Um, more solar panels. That's what it is. Three to one. Go with three to one. Three medium solar panels to one medium battery. Excuse me. One large battery. Do that. Do that. We're not quite three to one here, but we're good. We're 103 to 50. So we're two to one, basically. So yeah. So not quite getting the charge in. It's, it's, it's good enough. It's going up to four to half halfway, and I don't think we use it all at night. So yeah. Uh, okay, so are we... What's happening here? Why is this struggling? Uh, let's upgrade that piece. Should stop it from struggling. There we go. Bom if you ever, if you ever see a belt struggling when it's merging with other ones, upgrade one segment before the input, and that, that will actually make the belt... You see the belt now is all moving. It's not doing its backup things all the time. Uh, it's only a uh, 60 belt, so this will not, you know... This won't output 100% because it can't, but it will output 100% and that's it, so. Okay, anyway, anyway, that's enough faffing about. Um, you require repairs, which is microcircuits. You're not getting the microcircuits because we're not getting the silicon. We're not getting the silicon because we're just not getting the silicon, but we'll get the silicon, so that'll be fine. Uh, you do not want microcircuits, so that's fine. So you've got things, you just need Dura aluminium and composites, so yeah. Okay, okay, wasting more science points. Um, get that one and get the hauler upgrade yeah go for it okie dokie okie dokie so i'm gonna uh put a cut in here and leave the game running for a bit and um come back when we have uh enough to build the mdr and finally after 
quite a while. Quite a while indeed. We have our very first mobile drilling rig. Look at that beauty go. Look at it, look at it, look at it. It is gorgeous. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous machine. Ooh. Love it. Oh, I love it. You can just imagine it. It belongs, belongs on the moon. Belongs on the moon. Absolutely fantastic. Wonderful. Wonderful. And I love that the tracks actually move. Awesome. Doing, doing a little bit of a wiggle dance there, but that's okay. That's fine. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. We have our first MDR. Put on, put on, put on. Uh, Ratchet has said nothing at all. Um, and interestingly, um, I didn't even power the building back on. I left it turned off on purpose so that when it got the components, I could then unpause it and uh, we could see it. But um, it built the, built it anyway. So, uh, yeah. Really not quite sure what it's doing. Um, go over there. There we go. Okay. Uh, we're wasting science points again. Oh, wow. Science has really been done. I've just not been. Um, where are we? Uh, financial, social. Uh, let's get a couple of social things going, shall we? Boom, boom, boom. No. You can disappear off over there. Leave the base. Uh, I suppose what we could do then is build another cargo truck. Let's do that as well. Um, okay. What we don't have, however, uh, is a. Uh, and that, oh, that will go down to here. We don't have a cargo. Which wants to be. Uh, this is this is this is a bad setup because the cargo dock wants to be here. That's this thing. Um, because we need to get elevator coming down. So. Uh, I'm going to put the elevator uh, like here somewhere, I guess. I don't know exactly where. It doesn't really matter, to be honest with you. Let's, um, let's uh, put it there. Why are these belts stopped? Are you, are you require maintenance of smart concrete? Do we have any smart concrete? Do we have any oh so i don't have any smart concrete because of we're losing it for that so i need to change this priority it needs to come down to the smart concrete because we need that more than anything else because our miners can't mine without it so yeah all of these have failed here um yeah we're gonna need that we're gonna need that so hopefully any silicon that comes down will come down here instead now and uh end up in here and make some smart concrete and i can prioritize that to say make the store first would you please thank you okay so if we put that there if we put the uh cargo dock uh there well, and then what we do is we will output belts from these four onto these four elevator shafts They'll come down, there's four on here, and then one will come off and split between these two. Another one will come off to the next two, another one will come off to that. Because um, the fastest belt is 600 speed. The fastest you can get a multi reg lift going is 240, which is what we're at now. 600, uh, 240 times two is 480, but the f next lower belt is 450 because somebody i don't know i'm, I'm not no i'm not gonna cut but the, the, the numbers don't make any logical sense to me 60 150 240 450 600 does not make any sense to me at all at all they, they, they don't they don't i don't get it i don't get it especially when you consider machines don't work that way they they don't like the uh, the miners mine at 20 and then 30 and then 40 and then 60. So, why the second belt was 150, I just don't get. I just blatantly don't get. I don't know why it's not 120. And then and then we go you know, 60, 120, 240, 480, 720. I don't, 
I don't, yeah, I don't get that. Or, or even do the whole, you know, uh, not make that 240, make it slightly lesser than that. And I, I don't know, but I don't, the numbers just don't, they don't, they do not make a logical sense to my brain. So, yeah. Okay, so you would go out to there. You will come down here. As I said, and this will come here. Uh, right now, everything is screwed because we don't have any uh, smart concrete. Um, but I think you're going to start repairing things soon ish. Uh, you look like you finished mining all your stuff, so let's get rid of you. That might grab some smart concrete. What's up here? This one's done as well. Let's get rid of that belt. Oh, might get this one up and running again. There we go. Boom. That's titanium. That's not exactly what I want, but. Beggars can't be choosers, so we'll take it. We'll take it. Uh, you are on titanium and you're turned off. Let's turn you back on again. Uh, you're not connected to anything, though. Um, where is the belt that does the mining? Is that this one? Nope. That's. There's no belt here that is mine. It's for a miner. Uh, no, there's no belt over here for a miner. Really? Hmm. I guess I got rid of it. I guess I got rid of it. Let's, um... Just do a Mark II all the way through. That's not connected there. Where is oh we need to come in oh god we need to come in over here now that might be why I removed it because um stuff was in the way of it so you can run belts in and outside buildings so that's not a problem we'll do it that there in fact I don't want to do that I want to come back and do it here Can I run a belt? Can that's exactly the right length for this building. Nice. Uh, there's nothing down here, so let's get rid of these power lines. Doop. Uh, do we have the technology for? Uh, Getting super fast belts, uh, getting not super, getting the uh, we kind of do, but don't. Let's prioritize that up there, then we can get this one. Then I can get rid of these belts and start re putting things in in a much better order because stuff's just all sorts of messed up. Uh, so for now, we'll just run a Mark 2 belt into there. You connect to there, you connect to there, you connect to that one, you to that one. You to that one, you to that one, you to that one, you to that one, you surprisingly to that one, uh, and you to there, and you to there. Build. Okay. Uh, and then we'll aluminium over here as well. Let's, let's mine some aluminium as well, shall we? Uh, oh, we can get two in there at least. Okay, that's fine. Uh, and I'm going to run a standard belt from this guy to there. And you're going to go to there. I think this is where I put all the uh, scanners in to scan the outside of the world and things and. Uh, just haven't turned them back off again. Uh, so that's uh, 20, 40, and then that's 60, but that gone there. We can upgrade. This is not, this is already 30. So we can upgrade these guys. Let's upgrade those. Make them much faster. That'll help. We've got more aluminium there to mine. Uh, you guys are doing 60, which is coming down this belt, which is a 60 belt. Uh, my biggest problem I'm having is that stuff just isn't moving down the belts in time. Um, 
although everything shutting down uh, has probably helped the situation a bit. So yeah. Oh, we got our elevator in place. Nice. Um, let's um, plug you into the power grid. Our miners are doing nothing at the moment. Uh, I don't really know what's... Um, Let's come over here and mine a bit out this way, actually. Yeah. Do, 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 do a couple of lines over here. And then uh, remove that little thing in there. Oh, okay. Okay. Right. Uh, how are we doing on the surface? Let's see. So, right. Uh, oh, we can we can mine as well. We can actually scan on the surface. Uh, I forgot about that. Um, so I'm playing because I'm playing this game and playing the stream at the same time. Um, and they're two different games. I'm not sure. I, I get confused to where I am on what, when, where, how. Um, Especially considering I'm recording this just after finishing the previous stream because this episode should have been up a day ago and I messed up and I didn't do it properly. Uh, what do we need the most of? What are we really running out of? We're going to bet it's titanium. It's always titanium. Titanium, silicon, maybe a bit of aluminium. Um, this is such a terrible setup because uh, I can't see on the bus what's what, where, when, how. So, yeah. Um, so, we're going to want multiple MDRs aren't we uh but let's have a look if there's titanium nearby there is indeed um uh, so if i say use it here let's have a quick look at anything else in that vicinity uh no what if i send you to here so you can get some rare earth metals as well it's titanium rare earth metals yeah Go and dispatch to mine here, and you are going to pick up resources from the MDR. This is built now, which is awesome. Uh, I'm just going to connect one belt up to it, um, like so. Uh, because if I remove this belt here, and then we come in with the fastest belts we can come in with, uh, I think, so right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm gonna come from the back one uh, down. Oh dear. No, I'm not, because that's right in the way there. Okay, let's come from this one down, and then the back one. They are right in the way there. Uh, we could move the we will move them. We will move them. Uh, yep, we're going to move them and we're going to move them right now. So let's uh, put you uh, there. Then one, two, and three. You can power that one and that one. You can power that one and that one. In fact, no. Uh, you can pray all three of those. Okay, let's turn these on. Because we have to unassign all of the vehicles from them first before we can remove them. Okay, so you're going to get two. And then we shut down. cheap here is you want to come out and come down here and come through there as far as you can and then you want to end up here and from here you will split the conveyor belt um,
like this. I want to use as many underground belts because these uh, blue ones are expensive. Okay. Okay, so bomb, that's it. So it comes out of here, the blue comes out of here, comes down, comes along here, hits these two, will be split evenly between the two. And then these two will get 240 each, which will go into these, um, because that uh, red belt is 240. Bom. Um And then we'll do the same. This will come out down here and we'll do the same for the next two. This will come out for the next two and that will go up for the next two. And we'll have eight multi regular machines running all at once. And preferably, five mdrs one for each resource type and one for rare earth metals rare earth metals is going to be an awkward one because we're making it down here but there's not really anything we can do about it um you're all running fine for the minute i could probably put some more of you in and get some more concrete another one of you in here Oh, uh, yellow belt. Yellow, yellow underground belt. Nope. There to there. Perhaps I think we need to go up above yellow now. I'm honest with you. I do think we need to go up above yellow. Uh, because 64, 128, 196. This is only 150 belt. Hmm. Also, I need to plug this back into here. Even if it is a slow belt. Because I need it to recycle its own stuff. So, uh, and then this wants to be uh, well. Let's um, let's just go with belts and let's just upgrade these all the way, shall we? Because yeah, the amount of slag that's needed. I don't know if you can get mock mock two. You probably get mock two and mock three. I'm not sure, but um, yeah. Uh, but anyway, either way, we're gonna leave this one here. We're gonna come back next time and continue on from there. And. Uh, Hopefully, we will actually progress into something. Now we have MBR mining away on the surface. Getting us some uh, titanium, silicon, slag, and a bit of rare earth metals, which is awesome. Uh, you, for some bizarre reason, have just... Oh, no, you're leaving the crater. Awesome. So that means you've... Uh... Oh, got... Yep, you've dumped into here. Your output into here. Uh, you're right putting down to here, to here, and now you're broken. What's, what's happened here? Why are you no longer working? <gasps> because I messed up. Because I messed up. Okay. So, I did not filter these guys. So you have to output it rare earth metals to here. Yep. Yep. Okay, so I need you only doing regolith. That's slag. Uh, uh, is it? No, that's regolith. That's slag. Okay. Put on. Right, cool. Uh, so let's go back down again. Let's see here. Uh, yeah, you've got rare earth metals in you. Um, so if I click on this and I say, uh, would you drop resources? And drop the resources. And shift drop the resources. I 
I've got to keep telling it to drop the resources until it actually empties out of the uh, rare of metals. Because they're getting stuck. I, the only thing is, is that I can't tell what's in there. That's the problem. This had a rare of metals in it. Okay. Okay. But there we go. There we go. They're now working. That is awesome. Cool, 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 cool. Right. Um, yeah. Awesome. And now these guys are going to start running at full speed. Excellent. So, yes, we shall leave this here. We shall come back next time. And we shall carry on from there. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed this one. I hope to see you again next one. Until then, as always fun